Welcome to the conversation at airsafe.com. I'm your host, Dr. Todd Curtis. In this episode, I'll give you some advice on how to fly with a sex toy and avoid most problems with security organizations like the TSA. In October 2011, writer and attorney Jill Filipovic was on an international flight from Newark, New Jersey to Dublin, Ireland, and upon arrival found in her checked bag a printed advisory stating that her bag had been opened and inspected by the TSA. In the margin of the note, a TSA screener added an extra message saying, Get your freak on, girl. The bag contained a sex toy, and presumably the message was related to the presence of that device. The extra inspection of a check bag was a normal TSA procedure, but the additional screener comments were not. That TSA screener was later fired. While the TSA took appropriate action after this incident, the incident highlighted two important questions for passengers. First, what are the legal rights passengers have when it comes to traveling with sex toys? And second, how can passengers safely travel with these items? A sex toy is an object or device that's primarily used to enhance or facilitate sexual pleasure. Sex toys include things like dildos and vibrators, and can be made from a variety of materials. While some sex toys are designed to resemble male or female genitals, many are not. In general, when you travel domestically within a country, you should observe the appropriate laws and regulations of that country. When you travel between countries, you have to consider the laws of the country you're traveling from, the country you're traveling to, and any country you may be passing through on the way to your destination. In the U.S., when it comes to dealing with the TSA, the only limits that matter are the normal limits on hazardous or banned items. While there may be local or state laws restricting the possession of sex toys, there are no federal restrictions on ownership. Laws vary by country, so if you're traveling overseas, check the rules before you fly. There are a few common sense things that you can do to protect your sex toys and to limit the likelihood that the TSA will cause you any embarrassment or excessive delays. The basic thing to remember is that if a TSA screener asks you what's in your bag, just say what it is. Sex toys are legal, so there's no risk in telling the truth. If any of your items have batteries, remove them before you reach security. To protect your items from getting contaminated from handling by security personnel, put them in separate clear plastic bags. You should do this even if the item is in your check bag because check bags may be randomly opened and searched by the TSA. If any of your items are liquid or gel filled, these are typically banned from carry-on bags, but you can pack them in your check bag. If you have a liquid or gel filled item in your carry-on bag, the TSA may prevent you from taking it on the plane. Although traveling with sex toys is completely legal in the U.S., you may still encounter TSA officials whose conduct towards you may be rude or unprofessional. If this happens to you, immediately request to see a supervisor to discuss the matter. Depending on the situation, you may want to send a formal complaint to the TSA. For advice on how to file a complaint, please review the passenger complaint resources at airsafe.com. Thanks for listening, and we'll see you next time.